Today is August 5th. I started this video at about uh, 8 o'clock in the morning, somewhere around there. It's now around 11. I'm going to send it up now. I guess we should say that uh, some genius decided that we should have uh, a couple of Russian, I don't know, taxi driver, spy, mobster, uh, knucklehead things arrested uh, at Columbus Circle just outside of Trump International. I guess they were trying to collude and just didn't get in or something. And also in front of CNN uh, headquarters. You think uh, CNN might have noticed that some Russian spies got busted? I doubt it. Pretty funny stuff. Whoever came up with that one gets an A. You know, what are the morons fighting for? It's looked like this for quite a long time. Just looking out of, out of my hotel window. You see that one light on there? It's an apartment building or hotel. It might even be the Sheridan. I mean the uh, New York Hilton. I don't know. The Sheridan's down there somewhere. That's not it. And there's another apartment building. One light on. Oh, that's the Hilton. I'm sorry. <laughs> mm, everything's empty. You look at the uh, reflections of the. Uh, Neon lights off of the Manhattan. That was that's been empty for days. This was empty looking too when I was standing on the street corner down on I don't know 48th. This is 55th. It's all empty. That's an office tower. You can see some lights on because nobody's there. Hang on a second. Let me look out the other window for a moment. See the light on straight across from me. No. Oh. This is the. I forget what hotel it is or some hotel. Nothing. Just that. Yes, I left Central Park over here. It's a chandelier on this. It's, it's all in. Here's the Warwick Hotel at 6th Avenue and uh, 54th Street. Nothing except one light on. This building, which is at the corner of 55th and 6th, it has one light on that one right there. And you got that building there, it's got two uh, apartments with lights on. You got one light on there, and, and it's showtime. The floodlights in there. Look up to the park. Same on this side of the street, though. I'm just not going to take pictures of it. It's the same old side. How many pictures of empty buildings do I need to take today? Now at the corner of 58th and 6th, there's uh, this one. See the two lights on? That's it. That one's usually particularly pathetic coming out of the park on a dark day. And you can see down there, it's all... Think that's bad? Take a look at the side streets. All this orange stuff, we know what that is. Pedestrians, nobody notices. Joggers out, nobody notices. All the swagger and the stereotype of the street stuff. The cars are going around in circles. And, man, the diners are filled. Hey, I should say I didn't take pictures of that because why bother with somebody else for it? There are so obviously some of us are around today. I'm letting them all win. I'm uh, over by the Harry Helmsley place. That's that one. Or maybe it's Leona, the, the Queen of Mean. Look at this stuff. No paying tenants. It's obvious. Not outraged, is what the you know what the de facto is, what the de jure is. I almost don't care about, but you know that's the world where we learn that there's not. I mean, there's maybe one or two lights on or all these things. There is one building, and I'm going to show that it did have the uh, air conditioning on, but 63rd and Central Park West, something like that. One of those empty buildings. I'm gonna uh, head up uh, to a place so I can take a picture of the entire panorama. But I'm heading over to the side to the clueless. Gorkaya Maya Rodina, the boy Maya, he suit by. Oh, look, an air conditioner is on in the empty something or other. Pretty grim, isn't it? It's 8 o'clock in the morning, actually, a little bit after. Nobody's up. 
the weight. Here they come. I've taken pictures of this before. This is the Upper East Side on, on the west side of Walmart Rink. Like that all the time. Somebody just hit a gas something. I hit a fork in the road where I was coming. One uh, one guy was wearing exactly the same. And he was a nice daddy with two kitties out for a jog past me and then did the double Elbonian when he lit the gas off. Same uh, lovely nerve gas cologne as the woman he didn't know who took the other fork. This is really stupid. Oh, you got the Upper West Side across a ball field. They're all like that. Need to walk around? Maybe I do. Does it matter? Probably not. No air conditioning on either. It smells like mold and there's a gas around here. It's, they've got the whole area now zoned. And they're planting stuff and all. Those are the walkers or gas mules. There's one. He had something. Nice dog walker before full bird I think it's a full chicken he had that this is the west side look at it. they're playing with higher concentrations priciest real estate in the world all empty nothing at all well, that one's out Jake Tapper's window Jake Tapper's building is there to the right that Trump Hotel looks like it's got zero occupants I really want to hear another lecture from that what's his name Michael uh, I can never remember his stupid name. And then there was Brooke Burke. I saw her in the park the other day. Right outside where their offices are when they're in New York. And my Jake and, and Coop. Hey, look, there's a light on in one of the buildings. Anybody see any air conditioners on? That isn't. That's a, that's a puffy cloud in the back if I sit and have a wait long enough. Ah, oh, there it goes. You can see that. Perfectly timed. Good job. Look at this. I was looking down, what's that, 60th Street? See up the Central Park South. I'll take a picture up that way. It was pretty grim. They turned on one light in the building, though, to prove I was wrong. While I looked at it, and there was zero. I mean, you know, ex post facto it helps a lot. I realized it uh, wasn't Brooke, it was the other one, I forget, the 21, whatever her name is. I get them all confused, and that stupid name is uh, Smirkinish. It's always smirking, right? Hee 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 hee, no, I need to respect his hostage letter name. I'm tired of the morality lex, especially when I look at this. Oh, this is grim. We just busted some Russian gassers. I kind of read them the riot act about standing there and being idiots in front of this stuff. This pointless. They do the coward. They're such scary fucking spies and shit. True to true, you know, true about everything. And we passed a yo act with a silver bullet next to him. I don't know what that one is. He's really urban and stuff here at Columbus Circle, not noticing the rich people have all moved on. And that one. And that one. Somebody turn a light on one of them over there. That one looks, I don't know what I'm going to get over there. It's pretty grim. I'm now over on, I don't know, is that Broadway or something? I got Columbus, maybe. Here's Columbus. Fill the capacity, but nobody pays their Con Ed bills and nobody uses air conditioning. Except for the ones with the air conditioners hanging out of the windows. There goes a tourist bus, just let off a bunch of tourists who don't stay in the buildings. I mean, I have been looking at this for a long time. The kinds of hours of the day, even early this morning. All the same, nothing, 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 nothing. All kinds of stuff showing up to prove I'm wrong. But never talking about it. Look at this stupid stuff. Oh yeah, I'm at Lincoln Center. Well, there's that. You know, it's nice to being able to take pictures of the same thing. See anyone having brunch out on their balcony? I mean, why have a balcony, right? Magic morons were trying to delay me with that tour group. While they were trying to bring the sun out so I didn't take pictures from Lincoln Center again. Must be something about uh, second showing. This stuff is all same same everywhere 
What are we doing here? Why are these trees flowering now? It's August 4th. No, it's August 5th. We're trying to prove what? It's April? How about the other shrubs? Now on Amsterdam, which I guess turns into tent. Comes all the distraction skits. I think that woman was a gasser on the left there with the dog. And I've run in paired gasser games. This was VXB. Tenth and uh, Amsterdam. Tenth uh, and Fifty Seventh, I guess. Tenth is Amsterdam. Turns into a year. We stayed in that hotel. That was a gas house. This neighborhood's all dead. And the magic morons finally got the sun to come out, so they're taking a picture down the streets. Don't look as bad as they do. Uh, down the avenue. Don't look as bad as they do. On 57th, 3, 9th, and 8th. Walked this every morning. When I was staying at that hotel, was that four mornings or something empty. They even changed the name of the diner to Brooklyn from Broadway. To show that I was wrong about nobody being in it when I walked by at like 7 o'clock in the morning. 